gentlemen, and as always, thank you for watching. Uh, tonight we've been called by the Cape City Police Department. They've got a uh, truck and a semi-trailer on the interstate that's partially off the roadway. No injuries, but uh, uh, don't know exactly what happened if it ran off the road. Uh, they just said partial road blockage. Anyway, we'll find out when we get there. What we got going on, sir? He uh, looks like he lost his brake line. They locked up. Okay. Slid him, but he's empty. It is empty? Yeah. Okay. All right. I'll show you what he showed me. Well, empty makes it easier to get it back on the road. Right. That's no problem. Busted a uh, airline on a brake chamber. Yeah. Okay. All right. I need to get one of my service trucks out here so we can fix that. He's uh, in his truck. Okay. Uh, I'll get one of my other guys out here though uh, with the service truck. We can get it back up on the roadway, no problem. Yeah, I know you got it. Good. Yeah, he's inside. Okay. Hey Tom. Hi Bob. Uh, I need you to come up to the uh, uh, ninety-eight point four with the service truck. We got a uh, uh, me and Ethan are getting the truck or the trailer out of the ditch right now, but he ran over something and uh, uh, oh shoot, knocked the. Uh, hose out of the airline or out of one of the brake chambers i'll get it right here in a minute all right it's one of the field repair kits uh you could get one of the field repair kits the the quick quick the for the 3 8 rubber air hose you know what i'm talking about yeah it uh it should be the 3 8 uh well it it's one of the quick uh, quick repair fittings yep yep and it's uh, broke off on one of the brake chambers uh, we just need to get that fixed uh, after we get it back up on the roadway okay all right buddy thanks bye all right yes good and level you got a platform set okay now Bert, definitely first thing needs to be lubed up because first was, first yeah. thing free spool all the winches yeah. okay now you know the two flat hook uh chains that we've got here turn your halo on uh i need those two flat hook chains please Take them to the back of the trailer.
All right, you know how to fire up the remote? Get the remote fired up for me. What? rigging the flat hook just goes right up there and we'll make a loop we'll do the same do what bud bring me the or bring the remote fire up the remote did you get it synced and ready okay boom out Just did that. Yeah, sometimes it doesn't always take. Okay, boom out. Rotate it towards the back of the trailer just a little bit. Keep booming out. All right, that's good on the rotate. Keep extending out as far as it'll go. Okay, stop. and over I'll show you if we weren't in such a hurry to clear the roadway I'd let you handle this this is a fairly simple job actually yeah I will let you handle it but you got to listen to me very carefully okay all right we know the brakes are locked because he doesn't have air we need to make sure the tractor brakes are set up. Snug the winches up. That's all I want you to do. Where are your tractor brakes set? Okay. All right. We're getting ready to lift the trailer and bring it up. Okay. You want me to push the valve? No, sir. No, sir. I want both valves out. Parking yeah. brakes applied. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, sir. Parking brake applied, please. Yeah. All right, we're getting ready to lift the trailer, okay? Okay. You ready? Yeah. All right. Truck sounds amazing. Blue line. White line. Keep your white line snug, but you're gonna have to get your blue line up just a little bit. All right, just go back and forth between the two. Kind of like with the bus. Okay. Yep. That was not still in the truck. Is it? Yeah, he's all right. It's not going. It's the empty. The trailer's empty. Okay. Now bring your white up. You've almost got it leveled out you want it leveled out okay now bring both both up watch the back of your trailer you want to keep it level okay okay stop now here's the tricky part all right 
you go up with the boom and in a little bit at the same time which walks it towards you but it keeps the the wheels level okay so boom up first just a little bit and then boom in a little at the same time up and in up and in Doing good, keep going. Nice and slow, doing good. Try not to get it. If it was loaded, you wouldn't want to go that high. You want to just skip it across top of the ground. But since it's not loaded, you're okay. It's just empty. All right, up a little higher you're going to catch on the catch on the pavement it's going to slide in right in front of that outrigger let me hold hold okay Be close to that outrigger, isn't it? All right, now watch your. You're doing good on your angle, but you got to keep keep watch of your uh, boom angle. You don't want to run the cables into the top of the trailer. Okay. All right, go ahead. All right, go ahead. Stand. I know. Come on. Set it down a little bit. Okay. Go ahead and. All right, I'm gonna try something here. Come on, hold, hold. Don't, don't. It down okay, that's all right. All right, I'm just gonna skip this outrigger in a little bit. I've got my rear. Okay, but since it's empty, we don't have much weight there. I can bring it in to where we can get the trailer most of the way on the road. Yep, that should be just about right. He'll be right clear of the fog line. Okay, bring it on over. Remember to watch your cables. You got a lot going on here. Bring it over just a little more. There you go. Now set her down. Cable down, both cables. You want that tire a little bit? Nope, you're, you're, you're good. You're good. Okay. Cable down, both cables. Or just boom down. That's or uh, boom I in. Them. Boom in. There you go. You did it. All right, start taking the boom back around and get it stowed. Got it. You remember where to stow the boom, right? Yeah. You remember where to stow the boom at, right? Yeah. Okay. Eight degrees, zero.
watch watch traffic even though we've got traffic control we still need to watch okay go ahead and boom down need to turn the boom lights and work lights off so i'm not blinding traffic behind us Now, I've got it rolled all the way back. You can you can roll it forward, but you can do that after you get it. It feels like it's moving slower than you. It, it's, do you have it pulled all the way down? Yeah. Okay. When you're in a hurry, it always seems like it's moving slow. All right, you good? Hold up. All right, I idled it up a little bit. Go ahead. Now. You can also, on your speed, your winch speeds, from the slow to fast, tortoise to oh. the air. But no, on the boom, it's still not gonna move any faster. Yeah, no, the winch is going to really slow. Oh man. Okay, go ahead. Now, don't let the cables get slack. You need tension on the cables. Go ahead and bring them in. One up at a time. Well, it works quicker. They go quicker if you do one at a time. You get this stowed, I'm gonna go talk to the officer. Oh, he's not in there. Officer's not in the car, so I'll uh, he I, he, yeah, I think he went up there. Go ahead. Go ahead and get her stowed. Uh, I forgot where I had checked the angle. The high, Scales? Oh, yeah. Go ahead. That down to eight. And your rotation is at five degrees. You need to be more centered. Yeah, no, you told me to stop. There, so. Oh, okay. Go ahead. There you go. That's good. That's a one. That's close enough. It'll lock. The house lock will lock at one. You can gauge it by the hooks on the where they hang over the underreach. Here. Go ahead and suck it in. Cables up. All right, roll. Stop. That's good. That's good. Now roll the carriage forward. Good? Okay. Stow the stow that. As soon as you plug it in, it depowers it powers this down. Okay? Go ahead. I'll get the outriggers. Alright, what all do I have to do again? Just plug it in. Plug it in and uh, put it in the uh, cradle. That's all you gotta do. Just be careful not to knock any here. It's easier to plug it in and then put it in the cradle, bud. That cable comes out towards you. Get it? Yeah. All right. There you go. All right. Hop in the truck. I'm going to go ahead and get in front of him so that we're not on the interstate anymore. Go ahead so that we're on the shoulder. Hop in. Go ahead. It's the tire is desperate. Mom will be glad you're wearing your halo. Mom will be glad you're wearing the halo. 
coast. You, it helps you be more visible. Good job, buddy. No, just stay here. I'm gonna go talk to the officer. All right, I've got one of my service trucks coming up to fix the air for him so that he can be rolling. Okay. Do what, sir? The yes, sir. I've got a, I've got a, one of my service trucks coming to fix the brake chamber. Unless you've already got somebody coming. No. Okay. Yeah, I've got, I've got one of our guys coming with a service truck. Told him what he needed. He should be up here just anytime. Full service here, man. Is that okay? That is great. All right. Okay. It. All right. I'll hang with you until my service truck gets here, and then when my service truck gets. You said the registration. Yeah, registration. All right, have your answer. You. Yes, sir. I'll hang with you until okay, uh, right back. I'll hang with you until my service truck gets here. I appreciate it. Man. All right, no problem. Uh, I'm gonna go to the truck, and I got some paperwork for you to fill out real quick. You and come with you? no, sir, you're fine. You're fine. Okay. Stay right there. All you're right. you're good. I'll be right back. All right, we're gonna give the trailer a good look around. Make sure it didn't damage anything else in the process. So it broke the fitting right there going to the brake chamber which locked the brakes up on him and with an empty trailer it slid the trailer off the road thankfully it didn't slide it into the other lane it slid it off the road instead of where other cars could have been Looks good. That stuff off there so it doesn't get somebody's windshield when he takes off. To me, everything looks good. Well, knock this light off. I'll have uh, Tom refasten that light. At least get the brake fixed and get him down to the next exit and uh, refasten that light. It looks like that's about it. Gentleman sure got lucky there. Or blessed, however you want to look at it. All right, he's all good. As soon as Tom gets him done, he'll be ready to roll. Uh, Loving it that uh, Ethan's getting to take the controls. A little bit worried at first because he's not done this, especially on the interstate at night by himself. Uh, but he did fantastic. He's only 16 and uh, he took right over and followed instructions just like he should. Did an excellent job. Very proud of him. Very proud of him. As always, thank you for watching and God bless.